Hi everyone and Happy New Year. I hope you had a great New Year's Eve and I hope the coming year is a wonderful year for you and your family. We, Christine and I wish you the absolute best this year. Well, it's been a while since we've given you an update on the house and I thought it might be time. So we took this holiday to take some video and some pictures. We've posted some pictures in Picasa on our album, some new updated pictures of the uh, house and the, the, bar, the farm animals. We have 10 goats now, so it's really growing. You can see here, this is the video of our home. And this, uh, this shows you the progress that we've made outside. I will be going inside for a few minutes and I'll show you that as well. But uh, the outside's really come along. This front porch that you just saw there with the timbers and all really makes the house come alive in my opinion. Here's a, a view of the house from, uh, from the back. Uh, we are halfway up the hill and uh, got a pretty good angle on it there. You can see the uh, patio doors that have been installed. Uh, the windows, we're still waiting for those two big pieces of glass there. And those will be installed, I guess, within the next week or so, I'm told. But uh, all the, the shingles are all on. The decks are built. The timbers are up for the decks. The decks uh, railing still needs to be built. But basically, uh, it's coming along very nicely. The windows are beautiful. They're all uh, wood windows uh, that crank open. Very nice. This is the porch here, the side porch right off the kitchen I was zooming in on, which uh, will be a screened in porch. So it's on the north side of the house. It'll be nice and cool. It'll be a great place to sit on a summer evening. That's the master bedroom there, which is on the other side of the house. So we've got the kitchen on the left and the master bedroom uh, on the right there. So you can see we've, uh, we've made some, uh, some good progress on the house. We're very pleased with how things are coming along. We've uh, also made some progress down at the barn. We're up to uh, 10 goats now. We have two billy goats, both of whom have had an exciting couple of days because they've just been put in with the nanny goats and the nanny goats were very friendly with the billy goats. So let's just say uh, we've had some uh, fun on the farm here for the last couple of days with the animals, finally getting together, male and female, because of the expected delivery dates. Uh, goats are only pregnant for five months and we didn't want to have them uh, they'd have them have their kids while we were gone at Myrtle Beach in the middle of May. So we had to wait a couple of weeks, but everybody's doing what comes naturally now. And we're going to have a bunch of little goats, little kids here in early June. Maybe even in time for our big Memorial Day blowout, which all of you guys are invited to. We're having a huge housewarming party Memorial Day weekend. People be coming from all over to be with us, and we're really excited. So hope you can join us. Here's a view inside the house, and this is uh, looking back into the kitchen from the great room, and then up into the loft on the second floor. That will all be open there. That's a loft area, there'll be a railing. Uh, that'll be open, here's the open ceiling. Of course, this will all be tongue and groove wood on the ceiling itself, uh, so it'll look real finished and nice once, that's the next phase of this project is is getting that wood in and finishing off the inside. The electrician will be in with probably in the next week or so, and we'll really start to see some things happen on the inside of the house. There we're looking up. That's out through the front door uh, from the great room. There's the new fireplace. The fireplace was built uh, this past week. That will be covered with stone. So it, it will be a stone fireplace going all the way up to the ceiling. It'll be gas, so uh, it'll be quick start, which I like don't have to go get firewood even though we've got plenty around us I think uh, gas is still the way to go for me so there we are looking out the patio doors this is the dining room area here and uh, when we look from the dining room into the great room uh, and then uh, back through to the master bedroom which is on the other side of the fireplace so shaping up very nicely the cabinet guy was in uh, this week taking his measurements for the kitchen cabinets we're gonna have a big island in the middle here that'll have the cooktop, it will have our, uh, our sink, 
and we'll also have our dishwasher as well as a large counter space. It's, it's a big area there. And then on the back wall, we'll have our oven and microwave and all the kitchen appliances, refrigerator, con more counter space in all of our cabinets. Uh, this is looking out on the screened in porch and coming off the kitchen. And we're walking outside now uh, from the kitchen door, the breakfast nook door, if you will looking out uh, at our barn down below with the red roof and all of our creatures. Then we're going to take a left here. There'll be some sort of a door right in this area, a screen door will be, you'll go through to go outside on the deck, which is covered from above, except for the very point there. And uh, we're just walking along the deck here in front of the great room now and um, looking in towards the master bedroom side deck area and that'll all be sitting area. You can see that's covered as well. And then here's our wonderful view looking out uh, over Ideal Valley here on Ideal Valley Road. So uh, just, uh, just a real pleasant, uh, pleasant place to have your home and uh, all the fun that comes with having these creatures. You can see the ducks in the pond, the goats are standing outside. All in all, things are going very well here. We're happy to have you spend a few minutes with us to get up to date. Again, we wish you a happy new year and God bless you and your family. Bye-bye.